my thoughts and expectations of this season. I knew we were going to be good. Just we we're going to have to try and get over that hill of losing all them seniors from last year. I thought having a young team lose all that talent last year that, you know, I thought we'd have to fight for every game, you know, maybe beat everybody by like one or two touchdowns, you know, try to sneak out a few dubs. Uh, coming into the season, you know, I mean, we were confident, like, we knew what we could do, but, I mean, I didn't think we could be the state champions at the end of the year. Well, I knew we'd be competitive and win some games, but I never really imagined that we'd get to the point where we are today. I thought we'd be a pretty good football team. I thought we'd probably make a playoff run and stuff, but I never thought we'd make it to the state championship back-to-back -back years. I was just really, really wanting to get to playoffs, you know, and just have another shot to, shot to go to the championship again and get back at them. Well, I wasn't really sure how this season would go. I knew it would be pretty good, but I wasn't really sure how far it would go. Well, um, I know a lot of people kind of think I was crazy at the beginning of the season, but I kind of expected us to be uh, up there in the state championship. Uh, my thoughts and expectations this past season was was basically to at least win the majority of our regular season games. Of course, the last time the Cardinals were on the air, it was a 16-14 to 14 loss in the Dakota Bowl, the state championship for Class L football. What a banner year it was for the Cardinals. Lots lost to graduation, but the Cardinals are pretty excited about this new group that they have. There's a lot of big, big, big shoes to fill. Well, you, you look down the roster here for the Cards, and they have just a ton of talent. Uh, a fun year last year, and, and going to be kind of fun to see a new chapter of the Cardinals football program this year. As we're looking forward to the first game of the season for both Langdon Edmore Munich and Lisbon today. It's, uh, again, should be a fun contest here today. And out of the shotgun, Simon Rumpo works here, looking down, and now passes back on the left side to his tight end. He's got Alex Lowry, he makes the catch at the 40. He goes to the 35, to the 30, down to the left sideline, and he's down to the 20, the 10. Did he go out of bounds? Apparently not, or did he? No, it's a touchdown! And a great... And it's going to be taken by Simon Rumpo. Crosses, comes across the 30, across the 40. He's got a hold of the 50, down the left sideline. He's going, and he's going to take it all the way to the house! Simon Rumpel, we look back and we see no flags on the field. That's going to be a 75-yard kickoff return for a touchdown. The show back to pass. He's looking for Rasmussen again. Throws on a double cover. And the pass is intercepted. <laughs> it's picked off by the Cardinals. Peyton runs up across the 35-yard line back to the 40. And he's taken out of the 45. And Simon Rumpel back to pass. He's looking for a little screen. And he's got his ground. Rumpel has got a lot of room left side. Here he goes to the 40. To the 50. He's in Rumpel's territory to the 40. And taken down at the 37. Simon Rumpel back to pass. It's on the left side. And he looks across the middle. And he's got a man. And it's caught, I believe, by Jackson Delmo. It's about the 11 yard line. So out of the shotgun, Simon Rumpo will run over left side. He's got some room. He kind of uh, hesitated for a moment. Now it's actually going to be a hand up. Is that Sean Getty who's got it in the end zone for a touchdown? Taken by, I believe that's Carter Curry again. He's going to dash up across the 40 yard line. Well, we just saw our biggest hit of the game is, uh, as Curry just absolutely leveled Luke Dolls and trying to tackle, just not even close. Now the Cardinals have it back and running down the right side. Here's another kickoff return. Possibly running down the right side for another touchdown. On a kickoff will be Langdon Edmore Munich. And it is Sean Getty. How about Sean making it a miss here? And Simon Rumpo out looking to pass. He's looking for a screen over right side. That tight end screen. There's Lowry with it again. He's got a lot of room. He's into the 40. The 30 to the sideline. 20, 10, 5. Touchdown, Alex Lowry. For the second time along, the four receivers set, two left, two right. A more traditional formation here, actually. Is Schultz going to go back to pass? Heaves one up, and it's caught by Jackson Delbo. Interception for the Cardinals. And Delbo just played that pretty much like a can of corn out in center Rumpo, field. Rumpo, uh, final handed to Grant, who's got a first down as he cuts it up the middle. And has much more. He's going to break a tackle. He goes all the way to the 10 to 5, and he's into the end zone for a touchdown. Goes Simon Rumpo. He rolls to his right, looking to pass. 
And he fires, and the pass is going to be first. Put to the end zone, spot for a touchdown, and that is Jackson Delvo. And looking back to pass is Rumpo, looks left, throws right, looks for a little screen pass, and he's got Peyton Elliott, and Elliott has it the 15 to the 10. Elliott running towards the goal line. He's in for the touchdown. And he is going to fake a handoff, run, roll to his left, look at the pass, he fires, and the pass is going to be intercepted! It's picked off by Jackson Delmo right and on, on the, the shotgun to get his side of Rumpo. As he rolls to his left, but has a very uh, low snap, he's going to just hurl one down the field for Getty, who's there, and he makes the catch at the 30! As back to pass, it's going to be Simon Rumpo looking to set up a screen to Grant, and he's got it at the 30, breaks the tackle at the 25, Rumpo ahead of Steve to the 15, to the 10, to the 5, touchdown! And back to pass is double, now he's going to fake, he's just going to run it right up the middle, he's down inside the 5, inside towards the goal line, and I believe he is in for the touchdown! So it's going to be first down at 10, Simon Rumpo back to fire again, and he's got a pass caught again right at the sideline. They're going to keep safe inbounds as the receiver as a handoff's going to come over left side, and that is going to be a run into the end zone for a touchdown for 15 yards out. Hamilton is going to try to pass. He's looking over left side. He's got a man towards the end zone. The pass is going to be intercepted. And a blitz coming here from Harvey Wells County. They're going to set up a screen over left side. They send it up to Grant Rumpo. Grant sidesteps one tackler. He's got a first down as he comes across the 20 or across the 30. There goes Grant Rumpo down the left sideline. He is way out. He's got one man to beat. He goes to the 30, 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown. But... Simon Rumpo is going to get the snap, look over left side, he wants to go to Delvo, nope, now he's going to fire over right side, he's got Getty wide open at the 30, Sean makes the catch, and he's going to try to the end zone for another touchdown, 67 yards this time. And Simon Rumpo's going to pass. He's under some heat this time. He steps up and he's going to fire deep. He's looking for Delvo. And the pass is caught. Oh, what a catch. Jacob Delvo has it at the 30. And he's going to glide into the end zone for a touchdown. Back to pass now. As he's under some heat, he's looking to fire over left side. He's got a man in the pass. is caught by Sean Getty, who reaches across the goal line. He caught him at the got 10. The and he's in for the TD. And Simon back to pass again, looking right, he wants to set up a screen to Anderson, Anderson's got it, he makes the move, he comes across the 45, across midfield, Anderson's got some wheels. His, uh, Simon is going to take it himself this time, he's coming across the 20, across the 15, he's got one man to beat, and he's taken down at about the 14 yard line. The shotgun to Simon Rumpo, rolls to his right, looks to pass, he wants a man in the flat, he's got a man, and it's going to be caught by Jackson Delbo. Simon Rumpo again out of the shotgun, rolls to his left, and now looks back to his right, and fires over the middle, he's got a man wide open, and it's Peyton Elliott. Peyton makes the catch at the 20, and he's going to go right in for As the touchdown. Rumpo rolling to his right, looking to pass, he's looking at a little stop and go around here to Jackson Delbo, the pass is on the money, and Delbo breaks the tackle, and he runs down the right sideline, he's got a first down and much more. And now they're going to try a screen pass, and they get a screen pass here to Peyton Elliott. It comes across the 40, across the 35, across the 30, and Peyton Elliott gets all the way down to the 25-yard line. And Simon Rumpel is just going to get the snap and run out of the pistol. He breaks the tackle across the 20, across the 15, he has the room, across the 10, across the 5, leaps towards the goal line. And Simon well, Rumpel with the pass on the left side, fires the pass, is. is almost intercepted, then it is caught, caught over left side. Simon Rumpo come out of the pistol again. He's going to roll to his left. He's looking in the end, but now fires actually back over right side. Then he's got Grant Rumpo, and Grant's go wide open, and he's in for the touchdown. And now the pistol again is topless. See if he throws for the first time tonight, and he is going to look to throw. Looks up right down the field, and he's throwing deep, and the pass is going to be almost, and it is intercepted. It's back to pass to Simon Rumpo here on first down. And looking over left side, he's got a man deep, and the pass is caught at the 30-yard line, and down inside the 20. And Simon Rumpo rolls to his right, looking to pass, a little stop and go around over right side, the pass is up, and knocked around, and then I believe caught for a touchdown. Now they look like they are going to punt the football. 
As ready to do that is Shalesky, and he's put his block, and getting a hand out of the Cardinals. To go over left side, now wants to pass right, looking for Getty, who's got some separation, and he makes a great catch of the and he's in for the touchdown, Sean Getty. Motion is Thompson's going to try a swing pass, and it's intercepted. It's intercepted at the 40-yard line. But again, is going to fake a handoff for over the middle, and the pass is tipped, and it is intercepted. And a run over right side across midfield. Down to the 40 is Simon Rumpo inside the 30, down to about the 20 yard line. Simon Rumpo has tapped the pass tip right to him. Happy to get a quick play off here. They want to try to get two. He looks over the left side of the end zone. He's got a man, and it's caught for a touchdown. And Simon Rumpel's going to roll that way to his left. He's looking to pass, and he fires, and he's got Getty wide open at the 45-yard line. Getty made a great cut. Now he's got to the, the sideline, to the 40, to the 30. He's down to the 25. It's hit from behind. He hangs onto the football. He's not going to look at left now. Looks right. He's looking to set up a screen, and he does so to Grant Rumpo. Grant breaks away from a tackle, comes across midfield, spins across the 45, and he's taken down inside the 40 of the Braves. The uh, handoff is going to come over left side to Getty, who breaks two tackles, a counter handoff to Getty, he's across the 30, and he's taken down at about the 20-yard line. Formation here for the Cardinals, in motion goes Getty, they'll try that shovel pass to him, he's going to run around the right side looking to find the corner, he gets a great block, and he's into the end zone easily for an 8-yard score. Out of the slot receiver position, right side, no, going to make a catch across the 30, and Anderson will take it out to about the 33-yard line for a first down. And as Anderson will get the carry, he'll come across the 40, shoot across the 45, across he goes past midfield, and he's down to the 45-yard line of Boston. So Rumpo ready, he's going to roll the right side, look at the pass again, and fires, and the pass is caught by this tight end, Alex Lowry, who breaks the tackle at the 5 and gets into the end zone. Second down and 10. It's back to pass. It's going to be Simon Rumpo. Looks right. Now wants to throw, set up a screen. Left side. He's, nobody there, though. So he's got to scramble. He goes across the 40 to the 45. Or should say down inside the 45, the 40 to 30. He's getting all the way down. Dives in, inside the 10. Dives towards the goal line, Randy. We'll wait for the second and he's got the touchdown. See uh, Simon Rumpo just running it himself. He's running it back across the 40 across midfield. There he goes. Left side to the 40 to the 30. Simon Rumpo to the 20. 15. Looking right down the middle, the pass is intercepted. It is Simon Rumpel who makes an over-the-shoulder catch, and he's going to run it back into Ray's territory inside the 40. And with the Cardinals handout comes to Anderson, breaks the tackle, he's across the 30. He breaks her move at the 30, at the 25, I should say, and he's going to glide into the end zone for a touchdown. For running back out of the pistol, Simon Rumpo hands off to Anderson, who runs into one of his own blockers, gets out of that, and goes to the 30, to the 25, the 20, spins inside the 10, Noah Anderson. And what a game we have in store for you tonight. Two uh, teams that are 5-0 of the season coming in here tonight. Two teams that are ranked in the top five in the state of North Dakota in Class A 11-man football. Simon back to pass. So he's going to fake and run a quarterback drop. He's got a lot of room. He comes across midfield to the 45. To the 40. He dives inside the 40-yard line down to about the 37. Fire and pass on the left side of the pass is going to be intercepted. The pass on the left side is intercepted by Jackson. Getting in motion this time left to right. Simon Rumpel back to pass on first down. Throw it over the middle of the pass. is caught by Grant Rumpel. Breaks the tackle in midfield. There he goes. 40. 30. Breaks the tackle. Oh, he tripped up at the last Damn, hard snap down. Holding still or the carries is Simon Rumpel on the pass. From the flat, he's got a man, and it is caught. Simon Rumpel out of the shotgun, rolling to his left, looking to pass, and it is going to be a pass that is caught right on the sideline. Ooh, what a catch by Jackson Delbo. They're going to call it. On second out of six, rolling to his left, and that way is Simon Rumpel. Now he's going to throw for the middle. He's got getting wide open. He's got it. He's in the end zone. Touchdown. And Nelson takes a handoff. He wants to look for the left side. We'll get the guys where hit as he throws. The pass is going to be short, and it is intercepted. It's tipped off right side. I believe that's Peyton Elliott running up the right sideline. And he is going to take it all the way into Harrison Terry. Let's go to the right side. Wants to set up a screen. And they do to Anderson. It steps away from the tackle. He's got room now at the 40. Oh, he's tripped up across the 40-yard line. Back to pass, looking over right side, he's got a little time, Lowry trying to chase him down, now Nelson fires and throws in the pass, intercepted, it's picked off by Jackson Delvo, he goes to the 20, the 15, he's inside the 
Jones has yes. come in motion for the Cardinals on second down and goal. Rolling to his right as time in the rumble. Close one into the end zone. It's hot, is it? It's a touchdown! He's back to pass on fourth and nine. Looking left, looking right. Now players over the middle. The pass is going to be knocked down! What a play by Jackson Delbo! Horse carries it down by four. They've got to have six. Well, win the possibly win the game here. So second down at ten. Pink to Smith is coming to the play. And back to pass is now that he slips. Looked like he put his, his he went down. Now he's gonna be sacked. He's taken down way back at the 44 yard line. And that is gonna be the ball game. Oh. He's going to roll to his left, wants the pass. He plants and fires, and the pass is caught on the far sideline, and that is Sean Getty, and he will get the uh, catch on the sideline far side. I was going to send Getty in motion, and they fake the shovel to the center and hand off to Grant Rumpel. Grant's got some room inside the 20, inside the 15, 10, 5, and he's in for the touchdown. Yeah. And now Simon back to pass with a very screen pass on the right side, and he's got it. A, a pass is complete there. A pass is going to be run in by Graham Rumpel. He's going to get into the end zone, I believe, for the touchdown. If the Cardinals win tonight, they're up 22 to nothing. They'll clinch the Region 2A title and the top seed in the playoffs. They'll be Region champions for the second straight year. Uh, go to the Cardinals instead of Manabotion, I should say. And now it's going to be a pass on the right side as Rumpel looks for Delbo, and Jackson has it at the five, and he's in for the touchdown. Bruner back to pass, looks over right side, and he fires a pass that is intercepted. It's picked off at midfield, and the Cardinals have it. All right, folks, on third down, a three, a screen pass set up over left side, and it is the Grand Rumpel. He's got it at the 40, gets inside the 30, and he's got a big first down, another huge conversion. Okay, rolling right, rolling away from it, though, as Delbo fires the pass to the end zone, and it is going to be, I believe, maybe caught, but caught out of bounds, or no, it's a touchdown. The and it's going to be Jackson. A big handoff's going to go to Delbo, and a hand up over left side, and a run up the middle inside the... One inside the 10 down near the five yard uh, line. Shotgun here, and he slips a couple of tackles, slips another one as he gets down inside the, the, the 30 yard uh, line. Cardinals right. are going to be cruising here uh, to the victory tonight, and they cruise to their second straight Region 2A conference title. And out of the shotgun will go Simon Rumpel, rolling to his right, looking to pass. He fires towards the end zone, the pass is caught by Delbo. Did he keep his feet in bounds? Yes! What a catch! Leading six to nothing. Here's the motion of Tim Getty from left to right. He gets a shovel pass. He's trying to find a corner right side, and he does. He gets inside the 35. Now it spins off to the races inside the 30. Pushed out of bounds, though. Rumpel will get the play off, doesn't spike the football, throws, and the pass is caught the end zone for a touchdown. Crown is going to hand off, this is Noah Anderson running the ball for the first time tonight, runs it inside the 40th, has the 35, bounces off a tackler, he gets all the way down to the 20 yard line. They can hand out the door. They're going to swing out a pass left side of Grant Rumpel. It has some room. He tries to dive towards the end zone, reaches out, and gets it across with a touchdown. And Simon Rumpel looking over left side. Now is under some pressure. Gets out of that. Makes a nice uh, move and throws into the end zone. Getty's got it. Catches the ball on his knee for a touchdown. And a handoff is going to be picked to Anderson and run it over left side is going to be Simon Rumpel inside the 10 to 5 and he's pushed into the end zone by Zamaldi for a touchdown.
and Langenhorn Munich uh, will be the top seed out of Region 2A entering the playoffs next week. It's time for the 2018 High School Class A 11-man football playoffs. Today, it's Langdon Edmore Munich versus Ellendale Edgley Clume at Langdon. We mentioned that the top seed, overall seed in the uh, Class 7 on play, uh, 11-man playoffs this year. And Getting the one seed, it really boosts our confidence, I think, that we can go out and win the state championship. You know, we got to actually prove that we're worth it now and not let it go to waste. Fans think that, hey, maybe they respect us a little bit now. We had a great opportunity ahead of us. And there's going to be a fake handoff to Anderson. Rumpo is running it. Simon has got it inside the 10. Or inside the 15, I should say. Now inside the 10. All right, folks, coming right out of the timeout. Simon Rumpo will make a handoff and go on a quarterback draw. And it's a touchdown for Langdon of Warren Munich. Rumpo back to pass on 39. He's looking for a little screen pass, and he's got the pass complete to Grant Rumpo. Grant's got it inside the 30, and he's down to about the 23-yard line. Cardinals will have a first down and 10 for the 34. Rumpo back to pass. Looks right now. Looks for a set up a screen left side. He's got it to Anderson. Makes the play. Comes across the 40. No, it's across the 50. Down the left sideline. To the 40. To the 30. He's back to pass. He's going to the right side. Now it's down the middle and fires. The pass is going to be intercepted. It's picked off. Ready to go here is Simon Rumpo out of the shotgun. Rolling to his right. He is looking for Delbo on a stop and go pattern. The pass is up and complete. Oh, what a catch by Jackson Delbo. He's got it to the 30 inside the 20. Down to the 15. What excellent coverage by Jordan Carson back there. And it is back to pass. Here's Simon Rumpo. Looks right. No, looks up. Throws right to the screen. Here goes to Grant Rumpo. He's got it. Goes inside the five, and he's in for the touchdown. Simon Rumpo's going to go back to pass. Rolls left. He wants to fire. He's looking deep. And the pass is going to be caught. Well, he's inside the 40-yard line. That's Sean Getty. And off will come to Grant Rumpo. He's got a first down of all. He breaks it inside the 10, inside the 15. And and Rumpo back to pass, great drop. He wants to go deep. He's now he's going to step up. Now rolling to his right under some heat, and now he's going to run. He runs inside the 40, inside the 30, breaks the tackle. There he goes to the 20, flies to the 15. Oh, he cuts against the grain to the 10, to the 5. It's a touchdown for Simon Rumpo. So third down and 13, as if he wanted to go to Paulson on a screen, but the pass is thrown, and it's intercepted. It's picked off by Jackson Delbo, who's going to spin it back across the 30-yard line. It's going to be a handoff here to Noah Anderson, I believe, who's going to carry it all the way inside the 40. He's got it in down about the 35. Anderson makes a nice run. And now that is going to end the game right there, folks. We've reached the final as the final horn sounds here in Langdon. Again, 45 to 7 is our final score. Cardinals move to 9 0. They'll play either Kindred or Rugby next Saturday. Ready to go for high school football. It's uh, the Class A 11 man quarterfinals. The staff rolls right, passes on the run, and the pass is low, but it is, I believe, caught, or is it? And they are going to say yes. They catch on the far side of the field. I believe that's Jackson Delbo. And now Simon Rumpo is going to stutter step, trying to get out of some, trying to scramble out of a tackle, and he does, and he runs back to the 40, and he's going to be taken on after a short game. As Getty will come from left to right, is back to pass again as Rumpo, looking over right side, and he fires, and the pass is caught! Across the 30-yard line, that's about the 35, that's going to be great. And Simon Rumpo looks for a little screen pass. Now maybe it's going to be a lateral, now a pass on the right side is going to be lobbed up and caught. Now it's caught by Cooper Zimmer at the 26-yard line. And now running out of the shotgun, here is going to be Simon Rumpo, and he makes it on an up of them, it's going to be actually a... He's going to roll the right side. He's looking for a stop and go move here. And a pass is going to be caught as right. It's so short. Uh, by Jackson Delbo. 
As a snap here, Stop a Rumper on a quarterback drive. Breaks one tackle. Now runs this inside the 35. He's still on his feet. Being pushed back down towards the 30. And a shot. Just a low snap. Five and a half grabs it. Now runs. He's got the room. He's inside the 10. He's inside the 5. Spins towards the goal line. And run for is just shy of the goal line. Five and a half looking left. He's looking deep. He's trying to get a pass there, and it is going to be the final chance. They caught it, looks like. If this is a catch, it's a first down, and they're saying they catch it. Wow. And you talk about a big play in this game. We just saw one right there. A touchdown here should just about clinch it here. Two possession lead with this much time left, so that's the, uh, that's the goal for sure here on this drive. Try and clinch the game. Rumpo gets the snap and now runs up the middle. Now runs right side. He's got the room. He comes across the 15 to 10. The 5. He's up to the countdown. Touchdown. Touchdown. Simon Rumpo. Down at 10 it is here for uh, Kendra. They've got uh, 2.15 left to go and they're down two touchdowns. They try a little middle screen. It's intercepted. It's picked up. And that is going to be a score. So I think that more Minnick will be able to go into victory formation and they lead now 28 to 7 as Rumpo is going to take a knee and that is going to be the ball game. So again, Langdon and Moore Munich, 28 unanswered points today was not easy for them at all. Langdon and Moore Munich will prevail today, winning here in this quarterfinal game of the Class A Alabama football playoffs. It is Langdon and Moore Munich 28, Kindred 7, the final score. Folks, the semifinals, the Class A Love Man playoffs here in Langdon. We've uh, put ourselves in a good position today, being at home, uh, semifinal uh, Saturday, kind of, and, uh, you know, kids are excited, we're excited as coaches. Uh, it's just uh, a great day for football, and, uh, you know, we're excited to get out there and kick it off. Football teams are all playing the semifinals for the right to go to the Dakota Bowl. Winners all will go to the Dakota Bowl in uh, Fargo at the Fargo Dome. First down and 10 it is here is working out of the shotgun right away. More of a pistol look here. Bowman County, low snap, and a handoff's going to come over left side and buried in the backfield is Adam Powell. He's taken back behind the 30. Simon Rupo out of the shotgun, wants the pass, rolls left, looking for Delvo. He fires, and the pass is caught at the 46. Delvo's got it across midfield, and he'll take it down to the 47. And Getty off left. Third down and five. Simon Ruffa rolls to his right, wants the pass, fires, and the pass is caught. It's going to be caught by Noah Anderson. Far side of the field, he's got it outside the 40. And Rumpel now is going to roll left. He's looking for Jack Cadella. Now actually fires right. He's looking for Getty, and the pass is up, and it is caught. It's caught inside the 35. Third down, Rumpel's going to run out of quarterback draw. He's got some room across midfield. He's got a first down. Uh, down, to the, down to the 45 in Roman County. That's going to be a gain of about 12 yards. In as Getty will come in motion left to right, and they're going to give it to actually give it to Jackson Double is going to throw the ball looking for Getty, and the pass is caught. Oh, what a catch for Sean Getty! And he's down at the one yard line. And again, he'll hand off to Grant, who bangs near the goal line, and I believe he is in for the touchdown. We're down to nine. Simon Rumpo back to pass. He wants to go deep down the middle. He's got Getty, and the pass is caught. Getty's down in the 20. stays on his feet. Five yards. Let the five into the end zone. Sean Getty, what a catch. And what a run. Adam the machine. 46 yards. Ryan Box and the Cardinals have their first lead of the day. Wow. And the third and a short five here, actually Getty, they pick a handoff to him, and now they hand off to Grant Rumpel, who's got room across midfield. He's down inside the 40, down inside the 40. Rumpel rolls left, wanting to pass, and now might run. Now he throws on the run, and the pass is caught on the sideline. It's a catch by the 15 by Sean Getty. Quick, we'll work out of the pistol here. And wants a quick pass and it's intercepted! Picked up by the Cardinals! And that is going to be a touchdown! Grant Rumpo! An interception! A pick six! A 17 yard run back on the interception! And the Cardinals grab the lead on a huge defensive play! So the winner of this game will play. Hillsboro Central Valley for the Class A Level Man Championship at 9 10 and 1 out of the shotgun.
And they say getting in motion again. Goes left to right. And back to pass to Simon. And he looks over right side. He's looking and has a receiver in it. And to the 45 second mark here. 22 19 Cardinals. By Hovick to pass again. Looks deep. He wants to go left side. And the pass is intercepted. It's picked off by the Cardinals right side. And that is Noah Anderson on the interception. And the Cardinals, with that play, have clinched a spot. You would think you're Ryan Bachman to go to the Dakota Bowl for year number two in a row. And that's going to do it, folks. How about that? Lincoln up more Munich down 13 to nothing today at halftime. They end up outscoring Bowman County 22 to 6 in the second half. And our final score of the semifinal game of the Class A football playoffs. The Cardinals 22 and the Bulldogs 19. Langdon Mormonic will take an 11-0 record into the Dakota Bowl. They'll play a 9-10 on Friday And they'll take on Hillsborough Central Valley for the second year in a row. In the 21st century, doing something mean to it, do it better than anybody it's time for the 2018 Class A Football Championship. Today, it's Langdon Edmar Munich versus Hillsboro Central Valley from the Dakota Bowl at the Fargo. They've exceeded a lot of expectations, but hey, they've been doing it pretty much since game one uh, kicked off back in August here, right? I think they really just put a chip on our shoulder from last year's loss and just going out there and trying to change it, make it different this time. It felt amazing knowing that we we're in the back in the same spot, same opportunity to take take home the trophy for the school. I just thought, wow, we're going back to the dome. It's think that you know we need to actually finish it this time and do it for everybody. First down at ten, and Benson a hand up. He's hit the backfield and taken down for a loss. Third down at seven. Buffer rolling to his right, wanting to pass. He fires the pass. Is caught around right the sideline. They'll say it is a catch. And Ruffo rolling right, looking that way, he's under some heat, he's going to fire deep, looking for Getty, the pass is caught, Getty's in the end zone, touchdown, touchdown Cardinals, a 47 yard pass play. Number seven, the Cardinals up first down on 10, Ruffo wants the pass, he's looking over four, Jackson Dalbo makes the catch, and dalbo has got it at the first down marker inside the 30. Fourth down and four. Tyler up for back to pass. Looks right, looks into the middle of the pass. This one, I believe, is caught by Jason Elmo. Out of the shotgun is Tyler up for looking to pass. Looks right side. He's got Grant White open, and then it is for the touchdown. Grant Rumpo just peeling off right side out of the backfield, throwing the flat. And now rolling to his right side is Tyler up for First down of 15, and pass towards the goal line. Oh, great and it's gonna be pass. Oh, what a catch in the two. And I believe that's going to be Jackson Delmo again. Great pass. Uh, perfectly filled with football and great catch. Dangerous to run here for the Cardinals because there's 29 seconds left. They don't get the touchdown. They get the clock might run out. Tyler Ruffo's going to run over left side. Now he's going to he's going to scramble, try to run towards the goal line. He runs towards the pylon. Is he in yet? Yep. Touchdown! Tyler Ruffo gets to the pylon left side. And the Cardinals will take a 20 to 12 lead here at the State A Championship with 21 seconds on the clock. Here in this first half, and just another great athletic play by the sophomore quarterback for the Cardinals, right? And he's under some pressure, but gets out of that. Now he's going to look in deep, deep downfield. He's looking, and gets the pass cut. It's caught by Jackson Delmo. Delmo inside the 25. As rolling to his right, look at the pass. Is Gallagher fires, the pass is intercepted! It's intercepted at the 15! The Cardinal Roman back is running in his Simon room, fall back across the 20. And Simon Rumpel back to pass, he's got some time, he fires over the middle and the pass is caught! It's Getty! And he's got it across the 35! Now, Langdon of Morbidic, one quarter away from what would be the first ever state football championship in program history.
Cardinals try to bend but not break here on D. They still lead 20 to 18 with four minutes left. Balls down to the 15-yard line under three minutes to go in the fourth. The 15-yard line to the card, second down and seven. And a handoff will come to Benson. Excuse me, that might be... That might Is be, it long uh, for in the game? I think, yep. And take it down inside the 15, down about the 12. They're on third down. 2.30 left to go in the fourth quarter. Cardinals still leading 20 to 18. As right side goes Hennings guard, both crowds getting revved up here. As a handoff will come to Benson, he's hitting the backfield. He's taking it down for a loss. He's taking it down for a loss. That's a lead. And it's going to bring up fourth down and about five, maybe even six here for the Burroughs. Clock runs down to the two-minute mark. And I get, Randy, can we call this the play of the game, perhaps, coming up for both teams here? Right? Oh, absolutely, yeah, this is huge. Uh, so fourth down and six. Play of the game here, folks, perhaps. 140 left to go, Langdon and more Middick, Vinnie Hillsborough, Central Alley by two. And it is an eye backfield here behind Gallagher. And it is a pitch over to Chris, and he's in the backfield. He stopped! He stopped! He's he stopped! Elliot again. What a great he's play. Elliot. What a great what a great play. Wow. The Cardinals will hold Oscar Benson. And it'll make it first down and 10 for Langdon at Moore Munich. 135 to go here in the fourth quarter. All right, 122 left to go here in this uh, fourth quarter. Cardinals have a third down at four. The Burroughs now are out of timeout. Cardinals get a first down. They can run the clock out. Leading 20 to 18. They've got the ball at their own 23. Empty backfielder for Simon Rumpel. Hart's now coming. I believe they pulled the Burroughs offside. If that is the call, the wow. Cardinals are going to first down. As a, here's a victory formation here. Well, one more knee, Randy, and I think the Cardinals are going to have it here if they get one more good snap. Under 25 seconds for the now. Cardinals. Here it is. And down to the knee, Simon Rumpel has a good snap. And they've done it, folks. If you haven't believed all season, you better believe them now. The Landon and War Munich Cardinals have just won the first ever football championship in program history. Randy, can you believe it? I can't believe it! It's pretty tough to get any thoughts right now. It's pretty emotional, but uh, yeah, what a, uh, what a game. And, and who'd have thought uh, with what they lost last year to come back and be able to beat the, the same Hillsborough team? And, for the seniors last year and uh, just finishing the job that they started. We definitely want to get them back after last year and we didn't want to beat them just for us but also for the guys, you know, last year, the senior class, because they worked so hard to get to the program where it is today, so it felt pretty good to get them. It was, it was amazing, you know, just going out and doing it for the community line and all the line and all that, just making them proud, it means everything. It's pretty crazy when you start thinking about the teams before us. They got so close, but can never finish the deal, and it just kind of shows how hard it is to get to the top. It's the best feeling in the world, and uh, it's hard to explain it with words. It's undescribable. Words really can't describe that feeling. Like being out there winning that championship with your best friends, everybody you love, it's just amazing. Now for the state champion, Langdon Area F4 Munich Awards. Now the Langdon Area F4 Munich Awards. Please come forward to accept your championship.